Earlier in the day, U.S. Trade Representative Ron Kirk called on Datuk Sri Najib at his office in Putrajaya. Kirk said it was the desire of both countries to increase trade bilaterally and throughout the region through negotiations on a Trans-Pacific Partnership. He also commended Datuk Sri Najib's decision to incorporate the Trans-Pacific Partnership as part of a broader economic transformation to double Malaysia's personal income by 2020. And as you know, I think your Prime Minister um, made a very bold but forward-leaning decision um, to incorporate this Trans-Pacific Partnership as part of his broader economic transformation to double um, Malaysia's personal income by 2020. And so we wanted to express to him um, how critical it is that we continue to have Malaysia's leadership not just in our bilateral relations, but in our goal of trying to complete work on this Trans-Pacific Partnership. But we had a very good discussion. Kirk disclosed they also expressed how they could continue to have Malaysia's leadership, not just in Malaysia-U.S. bilateral ties, but also in their goal to complete the Trans-Pacific Partnership. Present during the meeting were U.S. Ambassador to Malaysia, Paul W. Jones, and former Malaysian Ambassador to the U.S., Datuk Sri Dr. Jamaluddin Jarjis.